It seems like Ben Affleck is settling down in Brentwood. Academy Award winner 51 is reportedly in escrow on a house in the affluent Los Angeles neighborhood, according to Josh Flagg of Million Dollar Listing Los Angeles. After paying $60 million for the estate last May, Lopez, 55, and Affleck offered their Beverly Hills residence earlier this month for $68 million. Amidst rumors that they are living separately, they recently celebrated their second wedding anniversary apart. Affleck had been renting a $100,000 monthly home near his ex-wife Jennifer Garner's Brentwood home while Lopez remained in their marital residence. Between 2005 and 2018, he and Garner, 52, were wed. Their children are Violet, 18, Finn, 15, and Samuel, 12 years old. After Affleck and Lopez hadn't been spotted together since late March, rumors about their marital problems started to spread in May. Ben already walked out and they'll probably have to sell the dream property they spent two years shopping for, a source said to in touch at the time, they will always be in love, but neither she nor he can make the other stop loving them. It could not have continued in any way. You had better believe that, Jen, will turn it around if it is just a question of putting in the work, stated one of Lopez's acquaintances who lives in Los Angeles. The source continued, she has poured her heart and soul into her relationship with Ben and won't give it up without a fight. There must be hope because there seems to be a lot of love there still, I heard. Lopez, who recently celebrated her 55th birthday in the Hamptons, is currently in New York City. Following the Bridgerton-themed party she threw, which Affleck did not attend, Lopez thanked her followers on social media for their birthday wishes. She wrote, I have the world's greatest, most incredible fans. There are no words to describe how deeply touched I am or how immensely fortunate I feel to have each and every one of you in my life. Thank you very much, Lopez went on. It's amazing to think we've been together for so long, she continued. As I sit here thinking back on the most amazing journey, it's weird because I still feel like the same girl who started off so full of vigor and confidence, so prepared to take on the world on the outside, but who was also vulnerable, fragile, scared at times, but always full of love on the inside.